Hey Internet, it's Colorful Artie and welcome back to Balloonorama. So we're on the fifth world today. We just cleared the Cartoon Zoo entrance, so now we're delving deeper into the zoo. We're in Grassland. Come on, Pep! There's plenty to pop! Not really. And we still have Super Pep, so we can bounce right through balloons without getting ricocheted off of them. Unfortunately, I have a feeling Super Pep's gonna wear off pretty soon. In your face, fatty bear! Darn it! Goodbye, Super Pep. Woohoo! Admittedly, the music in this world is probably my least favorite in the game, but it's still good. It's just not as in-your-face awesome as some of the other world musics. Way to pop the balloons. I do like how the designers take the time to actually make the levels look nice by doing like different colored balloons and unique shapes with the balloons. It shows that this game might be like a little boring at times, but it, at the very least is very fun. Pep, please just pop the green balloon! That's the problem. If Pep is actually moving at an angle, getting him to just bounce straight up is nearly impossible. Thank you. Oh boy, let's get the garbage balloons out of the way first. Lollipops for everyone. I gotta say, I'm doing pretty well at avoiding the garbage. Like, the one time I didn't, it's because I wanted to also catch the candy that was falling with it. Speaking of which, we haven't still haven't found the gimmick for this world yet. Rest assured, it's coming. I'm not a fan of it, but it is at least unique. Kind of. Oh boy, it's beach balls. Appropriate when there are elephants around. Come, Pep, we must pop all the balloons. Yes, that's what I'm looking for. <laughs> Gotta pop those balloons, Pep! Nice going! That's worth celebrating about. Alright, we're already halfway through, almost. Sweet! I had to speak then. Well, at least I can get those points back. Yay, extra life! So, unless I'm mistaken, I think there's only one power-up we have not seen yet. And admittedly, it, I don't think it appears until either next world or the world after that. It's a pretty cool one. Very unique. Aw, oh, Pep, you almost got it. Yay, we're going to bonus the first bonus level in the world for once. Bonus level. Only one alien? Come on, there we go, that's what I'm talking about. Poor 
aliens. We're just destroying their spaceships. And then catching them and being like, we're your hero. Give us points. Also, for those of you who are uh, wondering, yes, this music is used in my Sublems Lemmings pack for the Metropolis Lemopolis. I just take out all the atmospheric space music. Oh boy, yeah! Come on! See those flower balloons up there? Those are unique. Admittedly, I'm not a huge fan of them, but. Whatever. Once we get the yellow balloons out of the way, we can probably show them off. Or we can do that. So as you can see, those balloons contain both candy and garbage. So... Gotta be good to get extra points off of those balloons and avoid getting point decrements. So as you saw, I almost caught that apple core by mistake. That would have been bad. Since I'm really close to getting an extra O life just from my point count. Oh, I forgot Let's this gimmick appeared as well. So as you can see, the balloon spell car. That is not a balloon, that is a bumper. If Pep hits that, he will bounce off of it. That was terrible. The bumpers are really annoying. I, I thought those didn't appear until like World 8 or something. And great, I'm almost dead. Well, no one dies in pop -Up, but I almost am having a game over and need to restart. Yeah, as you can see, it just bounced me off like a balloon, except it's not actually a balloon. When you get those things in giant groups, they become extremely irritating. Especially when they're blocking you from popping balloons. There we go. But geez, I only have two lives left, and I can't remember if zero counts as a life. Super Pep! Yeah! Oh, I wasn't right next to getting another Pep. Rats. Well, I still got Super Pep, so that's amazing. I thought when I got 10,000 points, I would get a 1-up. Maybe that's not how the game works. It's been a while since I've played this game, especially- it's also been a while since I've beaten this game. I've only beaten it once. Come on. Come on, Pep. Pop the balloon. I don't want to waste Super Pep. Pep! Pop the balloon, darn it! Pep, for crying out loud, you will pop that balloon! And you will do it quickly. Because the longer you spend idling, the longer Super Pep is going to waste. I love the confetti sound effect. Dun, 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 dun. Alright, last level. I am not a fan of this world. Oh, yes. This is gonna be a sick combo. Yes! That is the glory of Super Pep. And wow, I destroyed the spaceship as it was spawning. That was amazing. Pep, everything that I was frustrated with you about on the last level is forgiven. That one combo made everything worth it. Pep, can you please get over there and pop the freaking balloon so we can play the bonus level? Pep, you are killing me. Alright, two bonus levels in one video.
That does not happen very often. And is it just me or did that last super pep not last nearly as long as the one beforehand? Also, once you pop the last spaceship, or pop, destroy the last spaceship, it's probably worth it just getting the aliens instead of catching pep, because you don't lose a life in the bonus areas if you drop pep. Or you could be a responsible pet owner and save it. Your choice. Whoa! I have never seen that before. Ever. That is amazing. I learned something new about this game today. And that's where we're going to leave the episode off for today. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. And wow, we are getting close to the halfway mark of the game. I will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, have a great day. And God bless.